Hey guys, it's Duanne, and I hope that you've had an amazing week. Thank you again for all the love that I received on last week's vlog, which was vlog 200, and everybody who contributed. It made my heart so happy and full, and um, I hope that you got the chance to watch it. So for this vlog, I'm doing some more wedding dress shopping. It takes place over a couple different days. Dana was kind enough to come with me both of the days. So if you are any chance in New York City and you're wedding dress shopping or you plan to come to New York City, I definitely recommend it because there's just so much to see. A couple that we went to are The Lovely Bride and Kleinfeld, which I highly recommend both of them. I don't know how often they film, maybe if, if it's weekly or specific days, but when Dana and I went to Kleinfeld, they were actually shooting Say Yes to the Dress, and Randy was there, went up to him, and was like, I don't know if you remember me, but we did a promo a couple years ago for Cinderella, the movie that came out, and he was like, yes, I totally remember. I had to hold that shoe for so long, like this like glass shoe, all this, whatever. And then he went on to saying like, oh yeah, that photo shoot, that photo shoot, like 10 years ago. And in my brain, I was like, no, it was like, just a couple years ago or a few years ago and it was not a photo shoot it was like this whole like video production but he was so kind he brought me over to like the receptionist table and was like whoever is taking care of her like please have them take good care of her because we did a photo shoot like 10 years ago together and I was just like so I hope that if you do have the chance to go to Kleinfeld to go bridal shopping that they are filming and you do see him and go say hi he is just has the most lovely aura I did not say yes yet but there are a few in my mind that I did really love and I'm still thinking about so please comment your favorites I would love to hear what you think looks best um, or what you really liked um, all that all that good stuff and possibly any other bridal stores in New York City that you know about please comment them because I would love I love your recommendations it is Super Bowl Sunday and um, we're cleaning having a nice time Diana our friend is gonna come over and watch it and I'm very excited I hope that you enjoy this vlog and come along. Oh, you look so beautiful. It really is. It's so oh, God. Like these are really like oh my god. It's really hard between this one and the last one even. Are you excited? Yeah, it's gone. You've got a little cinematographer here. <laughs> I know. I actually kind of like that it's chair right here. That's yeah. cool. Okay. Okay. Got it. So the back would be covered buttons all the way Pretty. up. Yeah. And if you were to line it, you could line it so the lining stops on the side seam. So the back would still be sheer. Uh -huh. But the front could be lined if you wanted the front lined. Yeah. If I had it all lined, if I had it, would it be lined from here down? Or you could do thing? either. What do you think would be pretty? I think either would be pretty. I think it's like your personal comfort. Yeah. Yeah. I like, I like the thickness of this, you know, right? Mm-hmm. Me too. Yeah. Unless you don't love it. No, I do love it. And then all like, like small stuff. Mm -hmm. I think the silhouette on you is beautiful. Mm -hmm. Do you want a, sh a heel? No, I'm okay. I'm fine. I think you'll want it later. Is this a thumbs up or a thumbs down? <laughs> My boobs look so low. I mean, they are low, but they look even lower. Your boobs are not low. Oh my god, my boobs are so low. Are you 
You have beautiful feathers. Yeah, I do. Super pretty on your skin tone. Yeah, it really is. How does this one compare to cap sleep? They're they're both, I think, equal. Okay. Still unreal to me. Crazy. I know. You're getting married. How do you feel with the veil on? It's beautiful here. Yeah. <laughs> Wow. Mm. And then you got the scallops around the bottom. Oh, yeah. Is it by dress yet? Is it free? No. You and your discount humor. <laughs> this is the real me that's coming out. <laughs> I can tell. Yeah, I like this. I like this. The scallops. How do you feel about the dress? It looks like that. It does. Wait, stand up straight so I can get it on camera. Yeah. <laughs> it feels more vintage with a strap, I think. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. Can I by chance steal that one on the left? Which one? Is old? Sure. <laughs> can you give her a bath? Yeah. Do we want her back? Yes. Just because I want her on. Yes, we'll, tr we'll try it on right now. Thanks, Matt. Yeah, it definitely gives a more strategic feel. I'm trying to envision like no, or no, no cups. No cups. Mm hmm Without the cups, it would still have that structured feel, right? Yeah. I think that's. Because there's a corset. That's so lovely. Because it is really, isn't it like so white? <laughs> mm, but it looks really beautiful on you. It's not like, mm -hmm. that, I that's not the something. I think the underlay is what's white. The underlay is ivory. Okay. I feel like the ones when we were out here last year, it was more of a new. Yeah. Okay. Since 1941, that's cool. That's what I was saying. That's why I was like, imagine going back in time to the 1940s and getting to try and dress in New York. We're just like... <laughs> I think meant in general, like in New York City, not like... Like, actually at Kleinfeld. Duh. <laughs> Give me that toot one more time. Duh. <laughs> oh, wow. Do that again. Oh, crap. Wow. Holy cannoli. <laughs> I was actually editing video from when we went the other day, and I was like, are you excited when we walked into the Lily Bride? And yeah. you were like, oh yeah! <laughs> like, <laughs> maybe that was a little exaggerated. I'm so excited to be here. <laughs> we have no recollection of that. Okay, so where are we? We are at Kleinfeld's Bridal by Kleinfeld himself. Mr. Kleinfeld is the designer of every dress in the establishment. Whoa. He'll be here shortly. And how how accurate are you of that? I'm 100% positive. What do you think of that dress? 10-10. <laughs> <laughs> you think you're good. Yeah? I think you found the one. Two thumbs. Yeah, my right nose is gone. That's good. I like your ring, it's very vintage. Thank you. Beautiful, very different. Um, can you see the strain? Yeah. So it's actually two different types of lace. Wow. Yeah. It's so nice. Yeah, I like the train on this a lot. So it's very, the train, or the lace that's on it is very vintage -y. Yeah. Wow. So it's a lace applique oh, on so top of the lace. So this is a really pretty neckline on you too. I don't think it's too heavy for you. The lace isn't heavy. Yeah, I think you're probably feeling like it's heavy because of the cups. Yeah, I don't think the lace is too heavy for you, though. Because mm -hmm. it's very petite lace. Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah, I definitely like this open. Okay. I think I like the first. Actually, I do like the first one better. You do? Yeah. Mm -hmm. What about you? It's hard to, like, imagine, though, because it's so big. Like, this one's the biggest one. I don't know what size this is. This 
Looks like it should be the plus size or almost. This is humongous. I do like this though. This is so pretty. To the me. thick strap. Yeah. How it's does hard. this one compare to every other one you've tried on? Um, I definitely love this neckline. Like I think right. I, I really want. Like I'm gravi gravitating towards. We have the neckline down pat. Yeah. Like this. Like open. Right. Mm -hmm. Um, I do like like this. The lace all over it. This is also a double lace pattern, so lace over lace. Oh wow. Beautiful. Yeah. Do you have it's a... really beautiful. Do you think so? Yeah. Uh, okay, so this is the number one contender so far, I guess, but it sucks because I'm not in love with it. I like it, but I'm not in love with it. I don't know what my deal is. This one is really pretty though. No, I it's know. very pretty. It's actually my favorite. Really? Mm -hmm. More so than this one? Mm -hmm. I really like the simplicity no, of it. Mm -hmm. It's very elegant. Yeah. Can I try a thing with this one? What do you think um, a sash? Mm -hmm. I mean, you could if you want it. The mm -hmm. little. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like a little sash, yeah. Um, what do you want? The only reason I say, when you have a fabric that goes straight down like that, and mm -hmm. it's like a uniform, I just feel like it cuts you off. Or you just want yeah, wanting to... True. It's like so beautiful. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Sorry, I feel like you're Zero to ten, right? <laughs> yeah. Do Dulce, Dulce de Leche. Dulce de Leche. From the finest spot for handmade artisanal donuts called Dough. And who owns the spot? The, the Dough Man himself. <laughs> Size comparison? Yeah. My head is larger than average, so. Yeah. <laughs> On the way walking to go get lunch, Dana and I stopped by the donut place. Who does that? Okay, so now we go to lunch. Where are we going? We're going to Bagatelle of Bagatelle Industries. <laughs> and who owns it? Mr. Bagatelle himself. <laughs> hey, what's going on behind you, Dana? Is that the back of the room? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, you tell me. Finally, go to the Quakers. Yeah, I really want to go so to man. They get vertical. We just talked about it with the Patriots. If you get vertical, are you happy with Old Maroon 5? <laughs> are you happy with Old Maroon 5? I'll only be happy if they sing SpongeBob. They did it! His face is like M. Now he's got real sex appeal. You know? <laughs> Well, I hope that you enjoyed this vlog. I love you, I love you, and I will see you next week. Let's <laughs> just say bye.